Welcome back to EA Sports, everybody. I'm James Stavalski. Final game of this road trip, which has already been an overwhelming success. Just moments away from puck drop, both teams seem ready to go. The Canucks kick things off by winning the opening faceoff, and here we go. Picked up along the boards by Hall. And now he angles it across to Pedersen. Great heads up play in the neutral zone by Bedard. Good hit to pump him off the puck. The Blackhawks played along the wing. Picks off the pass in the defensive zone. And that one's stolen at center ice. Here's a short pass to Olsen. Vancouver's moving it into the offensive end. Works it across to Pedersen. Pokes it away in his own end. Into the offensive end now. Back to the point it goes. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. Lots of time left in this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Lafferty's won the draw inside the neutral zone. Knocks the puck loose. And he coughs it up with the pass. And the puck's kicked free. And that's kicked out from the scrum. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. Receives the pass. Moves it quickly over to Zagora. Tremendous stop by Soderblom. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Scooped up along the wall by Garland. Shot! Here's a shot. And he comes up with the glove save. Ronick's body language says it all. He is frustrated. And anytime you're on a team, you want to contribute, especially when you know what you can do. You're a confident player, but all of a sudden, the stick gets a little bit tighter. Habits are a great thing. Numbers are another. Denies him! Handles the puck at the point. Takes a shot. Oh, what a save in front. They are really dialed in here tonight. Reaches out and uses the stick. Moves the puck over to Bluger. Big time hit in the open ice. Yeah, they're going to fight here. There's been an edge all game and a chip on the shoulder, and it results in a player down. Anytime a player's down, you know that you're going to have your teammates back. This was going to happen either way. In a word, spirited from these two rivals. Well, that's a nice way to put it, James. Every time you hear the boards go, it's an extra shove or it's an extra hit. But these two teams, every time they do it, they just have a little bit more. And that's why a rivalry is what it is. Action set to resume here after what was a wild couple of minutes on the ice there. Puck is dropped and play resumes. On the attack along the boards. Quick shot. Just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Wow. He's able to make a clean save on that wrister, James. A quick release shot and he's square to it. The Canucks have it now. Picking up some steam at center ice. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And he can't hang on after that hit. The Canucks gain control of the puck against the wall. Pinned up along the boards. And he takes the pass. Quick pass to Megna. Along the half wall with the puck. Sends the pass down low. And that'll free up the puck. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. And the puck's knocked loose. Vancouver's looking to break out. Chicago's got a hold of it against the wall. Scores! Oh, in on the backhand! That's a beauty backhand. Goldberg had no idea where it was going. I know I could never control mine, but man, is he ever accurate. Man, he makes this play look easy, doesn't he, James? He scores on the backhand yet again. How many times has he done it? If he works on this in practice, he must, because I'm telling you right now, I could not pull this off. The Black Hawks. 
Hawks have taken a 1-0 lead here past the midway mark of the opening frame. It hasn't been easy to get here, has it? We haven't seen any offense in this game, and they get the first one, and they have to find a way to continue. Where there's one, you've got to try and find two, continue to attack. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. Quick feed to Jones. Can't hang on after that hit. Taken along the wall by Olsen. Up along the wing. Taken by Bedard. Moves it to Olsen. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Vancouver's got it along the wall. And it's kicked away. Chicago's got a hold of the puck. And he takes the feed. Moves the puck along the half wall. The Canucks scoop it up along the boards. Vancouver's got the puck. The Canucks move to the offensive zone. Chase in front, and that goes off someone in front. Quick pass to Murphy. Here's a short pass to Kurashev. Shot, oh, he just got enough of that to keep it out. Puck scooped up by Lafferty. Through the neutral zone, up along the wing. Fires it. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Sends it quickly to Beauvillier. Shot. Oh, at the buzzer, a big save. A lot of people excited as this opening period comes to an end. One of the all-time great rock acts from the 80s getting set to play here for these fans. And we'll catch our breath. Back to Mortimer. going to be able to return to the game, James. I mean, that injury that he suffered earlier is going to keep him out. This is a tough loss for their team. No, and you clearly kind of know where you stand from a coaching standpoint now, but that is a serious blow to the lineup here for the rest of the game. The Blackhawks take possession in the defensive end. Moves it quickly over to Jones. Takes the return feed. The Canucks have it in the offensive zone. Quick pass to Heroic. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Quick feed to Bedard. Taken down and the officials caught it. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Well, the penalty killers are going to have to be the task on this one, protecting that one goal lead. kill for this team tonight guys and we know their unit it's ranked towards the bottom of the league but this team's confidence can sometimes overpower the skill that they show so let's see what they can get going here right now the Blackhawks take possession off the face off and the puck is cleared to a safer spot can't keep a hold of it after that hit along the right wing they enter the attacking area shot here's a shot and it's stopped by the club. Nice play there. Olsen's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Chicago's got it in the defensive zone. Nice play shorthanded as they get control of the puck. And they send it down the ice. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Centering to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Power play set to roll on as the setters get ready for the faceoff. And they win the draw here in their own end. Takes the feed. Oh, and he steps into the line of fire and blocks that. Too much traffic in the lane. The Canucks gain possession. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Gets it out of his own end. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. Nice zone entry on the left side. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Hoaglander got it against the boards. And a stick in the lane deflects that one away. They move the puck out of harm's way. And he takes the feed. Both teams back at even strength with the one goal lead still there. 
Well, and you have the player advantage and you're down by a goal. You have to generate some momentum and the first stop is putting it in the back of the net and now they're back at even strength trying to get back on the board. Vancouver still trailing in this one despite numerous shots on goal. Chicago's grabbed a hold of the puck. Here they come. Picked up along the wall by Donato. Poor pass on the play and the puck leaves the zone. The Canucks gain control of the puck. Centering feed. And that doesn't connect. Slides it back to the blue line. Takes a shot. Here's a shot. And he catches that one with the glove. Vancouver's trailing in this one, but it isn't for a lack of effort. They've had all sorts of scoring chances tonight. Kurashev's quick stick off the draw wins possession. Can't maintain possession. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Pedersen. Moves it to Miller. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Going with a stop. Slides the puck over. And he takes the dish. On man rush. The Canucks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Here's a short pass to Heronik. Poked away by Kurashev. Dickinson's lugging the puck. Tries to get it to Kurashev. Throws it in. Vancouver's got a hold of it along the wall. Hughes takes the puck. Chicago's got it behind the net. Sends the pass over. The Canucks take possession in the neutral zone. Oh, he hit him and got all of it. Oh, that's a tough one, James. You're along the boards. They don't have a lot of give. What that means, you're feeling it all. Read that perfectly with the poke check. Feeds it over to Cole. The Blackhawks have it in the offensive end. Feeds the puck across to Donato. Shot! Huge blocker saved by Demko. Well, that Mr. had some heat, James, but he was able to get in front of it and turn it aside. Moves it on over to Mikheyev and tries to make a diagonal pass to Garland. Looks like we got a penalty coming up here. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. There's the whistle, and here's the call. He needs to find a way to manage his emotions here because they're creeping into his game. That's a second penalty he's taken this period. Guys, we know this penalty kill is ranked toward the bottom of the league, but tonight they've already successfully shut down this power play here. Let's see what they can do with this next opportunity and see if they're able to shut them down again. Olsen's won it off the faceoff. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. The Canucks pick up steam and are on the attack. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. The Canucks will play it from the defensive zone. Vancouver's got the puck against the half wall. Chicago's got possession of the puck. The Canucks gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. Sends it in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. And that's intercepted by Blackwell. Grabbed along the board by Miller. Snaps it on net. uncomfortable stretching your body finding a way to make yourself as big as possible to get to the save that's what he did and that's why the save was made they got a face off coming up here in the offensive end and the goaltender looks fatigued james so the best medicine right now for them is to find a way to put the puck to the net chicago's got the win off that draw and they move the puck out of harm's way The Canucks gain possession along the wall. Gives him a whack, and the officials are going to call this one. 
The Canucks carry it along the wall. There's a shot and a huge stop by the goaltender. Oh. Point blank range. Well, look at this, Cheryl. Here we go. The parade is officially underway. It certainly is. And everyone in the building, you can hear the crowd just cheering with their frustration, including everyone on the bench, completely deflated right now. A non-stop procession with a penalty box for the home team. The Canucks send their man advantage unit out once more. Well, in a one-goal deficit on the power play now, you have to take advantage. You have to find a way to get the coverage moving and find good scoring opportunities. The Blackhawks will kill off a few extra seconds now. And they get that puck down the ice. Moves it quickly over to Johnson. The Blackhawks play it along the boards. What a steal in his own end. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Stopped by the goaltender. Well, this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it, you've got to be fast, you've got to be quick and show those reflexes, he does that and makes the save. Pitlick's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Chicago's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Takes the pass. And now it's over to Pitlick. The Canucks look to start the transition game. Under a minute to go here inside the second period. Takes a shot. Oh, puts it wide and oh, you know he'll want that one back. Well, you can see the frustration right there. I think there was a sense of urgency, but he had more time than he thought. Here's a chance to get it out of their own end. And that's off the glass and out. And there's one non-negotiable if you're going to be on a PK, James, and that is you've got to get the clear, and this is done perfectly. Demko's off to Dan, hang on to the puck for a face-off. Olsen's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out. Well, there you go. We played 40 minutes. Final chance for the coaches to push their messages home. And we'll see the third period coming up in just a matter of moments. Teams are lined up, and they are ready to get this third period underway. And they have dropped the puck here on the final frame. Well, Pounder, we've played more than 40 minutes now in this one. How do you view things? Vancouver's had a lot of pace and tempo through the first 40 minutes of play. James, if they can continue that along with their possession time, you got to believe that they can get the equalizer in this one. Jocelyn for the puck, and he loses control. Chicago's got a hold of the puck now. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. There's no question the goaltenders know who the shooters are in the league and what style of shot they take, and he's able to get a per... It's a two-on-one! Into the offensive zone! Oh, and the rush comes to an end. I thought they deserved a better fate there. Picked up along the boards by Hironik. Inside his own end, moves the puck. Quick pass across to Miller. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. The Canucks take possession here in the open ice. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Puts it on net. Lays out to get in front of that one. And he makes a save there. And now he moves it quickly to Kurashev. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. Angles it over to Garland. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. Great read by Zadorov. Jones is taken down. A penalty is coming up. And the Blades whistle dead. Here's the call. Well, when you're looking for the equalizer, it's tough to take a penalty and play shorthanded. James, you got to find a way to get to even strength so you can generate some offense. And their first chance to use the man advantage. First power play opportunity for this team. It's going to start in the face-off circle, getting possession with the win, and then looking to set up. 
Shooters want it in their own end. Zadorov's got it in the defensive end. Fires it into the offensive zone. Slides it diagonally to Radish. And that's just out of reach. And they'll keep on playing as icing is waved off. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. Here they come on the attack. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Oh, what a save! Looking textbook there. Chicago's got the puck along the boards. And they'll go on the attack. Great pressure by Suter. Great reach with the poke check. Quick pass to Dickinson. Oh, relentless pressure, and they come up with the turnover. Turn that chance aside. The Blackhawks are in transition. Quick feed to Dickinson. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Brilliant save, read it perfectly. The Canucks take it along the wing. Here's a chance. Puts it off the outside of the frame. The Canucks are trying to shrink their deficit in this game. They're playing aggressive in the offensive zone, and they just wire one off the post as they try and claw their way back in. Oh, the razzle-dazzle! The Blackhawks have it now. Hall's got the puck along the wing. Huge steal in his own end. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. Well, he typically scores when he gets these opportunities. He is their emotional leader. He inspires this entire group. That was a huge save for the goaltender to make. Well past the midway mark of this period, the Blackhawks lead it 1-0. Pitlick's won a big draw on their own end. Murphy swinging the puck through center ice. And they'll dump it in. Zadorov's got the puck in his own zone. Moves it to Garland. The Blackhawks have done a great job protecting the middle of the ice and influencing play to the outside and allowing their tender to see every shot. Now they're protecting a shutout. They're going to have to do a little more of the same if they want to get it. And now it's grabbed by Vlasic. Chicago's on the attack. Sanford's got it in the corner. Scooped up along the wall by Lafferty. Line change. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. The Blackhawks gain possession. Textbook poke check by Myers. He's only one goal away, James, from his next milestone right here. Denied by the goaltender. Great defensive effort with the stick. And it's a quick pass to Vlasic. Takes a shot. Oh, pad save. Tremendous agility there by Demko. Pittsburgh's up next as this homestand will continue. And a team that when they're playing well, they are a tough out with the offense that they can provide. We will see them. The Canucks win it in the defensive zone. Coles taking it from his own end. Takes the feed. Can't get a hold of that pass. Scores! And that one going off the defender for an own goal. Well, he's been on a heater all game, James. I mean, so dialed in, tracking the puck effectively, controlling his rebounds, and this one just squeaks by him. He's going to have a hard time with that one because he just lost the shutout. The Canucks have jumped right back into this one and not a moment too soon in the third. Oh, we have ourselves a game here, don't we, James? And this is what everyone wants. They love these nail biters right to the finish. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Vancouver's got it along the wall. Smart defensive play there. Here's a shot. Flashes the leather. What a save by Soderblom. I love that he swallowed this one up with his glove. It's a real threat coming from the slot area. No rebound to boot. Just here in the late stages of this frame, we are all tied up in this one. The Blackhawks come up with the defensive zone draw. Chicago's got it in their own zone. Dumps it in. Take it along the wall by Olsen. Shuts him down. 
Demko has been dialed in right from puck drop, James. I mean, he's made the key save that he's need to make, and it's all about for a tender managing the momentum swings of the game, and the timeliness of the saves have really given his team an opportunity. Bedard swooping in on the attack. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. And he slides it quickly to Miller. Fires it on net. That's blocked. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Chris shot from the slot. The goalie's best friend comes up big again as it goes off the outside of the frame. Ronick's had a tough time around the net tonight, James. It's hitting the bar. He's got to find a way to cash in, you know, with his hands. At some point, if he gets the opportunity, he's going to put it in. And there's the horn. 60 minutes solves absolutely nothing. Let's go to the period where heroes are made. Overtime looms here on EA Sports. Overtime, moments away. Time to find out if we get a winner here. Overtime, the puck is dropped. Play whistle dead offside the call. Setters gliding up to the face-off dots here. And after the draw center, they've got a hold of the puck. Skates to the crease. Huddled away by Soderblom. The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. A chance to win it. Oh, we are still tied. What a stop. Look at this. Over the line. Here's a pass. Oh, fantastic save. It crushes the rush. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. The Canucks win the defensive zone face-off. Vancouver's got the puck in the defensive end. What a chance here! Oh, tremendous save to shut down the rush there! Wow! And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. The Canucks win it. Puck grab by Hirona. Picks up. He's got a little jump. He's clear. Oh, it just kind of muffles that one. Well, he muffles it because he's in tight. When you're in tight, you run out of room and you run out of option as well. You've got to find a way to get the puck to the net. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone face-off. The Canucks win the draw here in their own end. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. And he makes the save on that play. Uh, he's reading these shooters so well. He's getting in front of them. He's aggressive. And he's challenging them to beat him, James. And that's what I love about him. A ton of confidence. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. And they win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. With possession along the wall. Here's a short pass to Bernard. And knocks it down out of midair. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Directs it on over to Olsen. Nice hit on the play there. Oh, we'll get some tired defenders as icing is the call. A critical draw here. The Blackhawks win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Center bears down on that bottom hand. Oh, they win it! They win it! They win it! A special night, and even more special with this main base on a Sydney weapon. Unreal. Shot off the most coveted area on the ice, right in front of the pain. Doesn't allow the goalie to get set up and puts it home. 
awesome destinations in the hockey landscape, and here's a reason why. Look at the celebration here, Cheryl. And you gotta love this. I mean, the fans are there for you while you're playing the game, and you come back out to say thank you to them. Fun night at the Rink, and for all of us here on the EA Sports team, I'm James Sabalski. Good night.